Governor Steve Bullock says in Montana, if it does, it does see another epic fire season like last year, his administration will rise to the challenge and he will do whatever it takes in terms of cost to fight the fires. The last predictions are showing an above average fire season for this year. Multiple state agencies briefed Governor Steve Bullock on how they are preparing to battle the blazes. MTN's Jacob Fuhrer was at the briefing and has more. To come up with an accurate picture of just how bad this upcoming fire season could be, meteorologists look at a few factors. They need to understand what forest fuels are available, how dry the state is, and how much moisture is still in the forecast. They are forecasting uh, for most of July, August, and September warmer and drier than average conditions uh, from the Continental Divide westward in Montana. Meteorologists say that warm, dry weather could translate into a harsh fire season with the potential for many fires starting in late July. The fire season could also be longer than last year, extending into September or even early October. On Thursday, a handful of state agencies briefed Governor Steve Bullock on the preparations. All of us as Montana certainly have to prepare for the worst, yet also hope for the best when it comes to this fire season. The Department of Natural Resources and Conservation, Bureau of Land Management, the Forest Service, and others are training fire crews and checking ground equipment and aircraft to be ready at a moment's notice. Governor Bullock said the state has also secured funds to train the National Guard to fight fires if need be, rather than just providing security. With regard to the cost for fighting potential fires, Bullock said he'll do whatever it takes. We will continue to do everything we can to protect safety firefighters, safety Montanans, and personal property. I certainly hope that we don't have a fire season um, like we did last uh, year, but if we do, we will rise to the challenge and we will figure it out. In Helena, Jacob Fuhrer, MTN News.